mix and mash of the best freestyle music exclusive tweet us now jingle bell jingle bell jingle bell rock jingle bell swing and jingle bell ring snowing and blowing in bushels of fire now the jingle hop has begun jingle bell jingle bell jingle bell rock jingle bells chime in jingle bell time dancing and prances with jingle bell squares in the frosty Best music. Feature of the week. Exclusive live mix. Across the spectrums of house music. Playing the latest hits. The best music on the best radio. of top online radio uk i wherever you are whatever language it's christmas merry christmas happy christmas to you i hope so we are all well by his grace uh today is christmas and we are bringing you a christmas edition of in his presence a special edition of in his presence courtesy of reverend Jacob Van der Poy of the Wheeling Intercessors Network. Someone will say, wow, uh, I don't think Reverend will be around for this time, you know, it's <laughs> Christmas, so, but he's here. We are blessed. Amen. Welcome Amen. to the program, Reverend Van der Poy. How are you and the family, sir? Uh, Merry Christmas, DJ KB. Happy. Merry Christmas, uh, Top Online Radio. Amen, amen, amen. We are blessed unto us a Savior has been born. Amen. And we are in the celebration mood. Yes. The Lord is good. All the it's, time. We thank God. We thank God for your life, life, amen, your family, amen. and your ministry. Amen. Thank you for this is a special edition of In His Presence. We are privileged to have Reverend Van der Poy with us. So, um, 
let's see um right S let me bring reverend van der Poy. okay right so uh, as i said today is christmas um but we have to listen to the word of god um uh, most importantly because it's christmas so um let me just let reverend van der Poy, uh, take it away reverend what does the Lord have for us on this special day? Thank you. Amen. Amen. This is the day that the Lord has made. And once again, I wish you a Merry Christmas. A Savior has been born. And we are in the celebration mood. I welcome you to the program in His presence. Amen. Joy and a privilege to come your way. I thank you for joining us and share the link. Share the link that others may enjoy, enjoy the program as well. Amen. Christmas Day, all said and done, attributing the day not to the birth of Jesus Christ, we know we are celebrating our King, our Savior. So precious, Daughter, precious son of God, dearly beloved, mm. let's give thanks unto the Lord. Amen. I want us to enter his gates with thanksgiving. Amen. Ascribe the glory and the honor unto the wonderful name of Jesus. Amen. Christ is born unto us. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. That whilst we were yet sinners, he demonstrated his love. May the love of God be commended in your home. Amen. Goodness and mercy will follow you. Amen. At this time of the night of Christmas, I know you've enjoyed your turkey. You've enjoyed your everything you want to enjoy. And it's good. It's a love of the Lord. And I know families are united. May the peace of God that passes all understanding be your portion at this very day. Amen. The hand of God be upon you. Joy, joy unspeakable be unto your household. Amen. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Holy, holy is the Lord. For the anointing has been poured upon our head. And tonight, you will stand tall and you will see the salvation of the Lord. Amen. Father, we ascribe all the glory unto you. Join me in singing unto the Lord a new song. Join Amen. me in giving praise unto the Lord. For 12 months of 2023, God has brought you to the 25th of the last month. And his mercies and his goodness will keep us till 31st. And he will take us into 2024. Amen. And there will be divine, divine providence, Amen. divine encounters, divine locations in our lives. Amen. Oh, prepare your heart for us to uh, share the word of God. Amen. Talk about the gift that has been given unto us. A wonderful counselor. The everlasting father. The prince of peace. And he, the government is upon his shoulders. Amen. Of his increase, there shall be no end. He will order your steps. He has ordered your steps and he has established everything in accordance with the peace of God. Amen. Dearly beloved, give audience to the Holy Spirit. I, I encourage you not to hear the voice of a man, but let the oracles of God be spoken into your situation tonight. May the Holy Spirit brood over each and every one of us in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Joy, joy unspeakable, I bring into your home tonight. 
Amen. On this Christmas day, on this festivity of the Savior being born unto all men. May grace and mercy ab abound in, in your abode. Amen. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Amen. DJ KB, God bless you. God bless Top Online Radio Amen. for the whole year. You have, uh, you have made provision for our coming and for our journey on the program. Amen. It's been an interesting year. Yes. But God will lift us from one degree of glory to another. Mm -hmm. And tonight, we what can we talk about again? It's only about the Savior. Yes. It's only about the gift. It's only about the love of God. And tonight, I just simply say, a Savior has been born. Amen. A Savior has been born. King of kings. The king of all reigns. The king of humanity. And Isaiah, I will read two scriptures in Isaiah. First of all, let's read Isaiah 9, 6, and 7. Isaiah 9, 9 verse 6 and 7. All right. I'll take that. Isaiah. Uh, give me one sec. My Bible. Chapter 9, verse 6 and 7. Yeah. Come on, okay. <laughs> Are you Sometimes, there? Sometimes, yes. Isaiah okay. 9, 6, and 7. Right, I read. Mm -hmm. Then the woman... Oh, sorry. 9, 6, and 7. If you want me to yes. read out. For unto us a child is born. Unto us... A son is given, and the government will be upon his shoulder, and his name will be called Wonderful, Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. Of the increase of his government and peace, there will be no end. Seven of the increase of his government and peace, there will be no end upon the throne of David and over his kingdom to order it and establish it with judgment and justice from that time forward, even forever. The zeal of the Lord of hosts will perform this. Amen. 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 Justice is upon the government of Jesus Christ. Dearly beloved, the testament or the, the revelation is that God gave us his only begotten son. He, he was born unto us and his name was wonderful. Wonderful Jesus. He has performed a miracle in your life. So as you celebrate the birth of Jesus Christ, there is a miracle that was made available to you. He's a counselor. That's why we need the wisdom of God. Wisdom is in the name of Jesus. His name is a counselor. His name is wisdom. Hallelujah. Amen. And is the mighty God. There is no challenge. He's the mighty God. He's the everlasting Father, the Prince of Peace. The, the government shall be on his shoulder. Of his government, there shall be no end. Hallelujah. Amen. So, the, the, the virgin birth and the coming of Jesus was so peculiar, was so important. And by his coming, we were saved from destruction. Mm -hmm. By his coming, the government, he will form a government. And that government has no hand. 
So, child of God, if you love Jesus, if you understand the birth, and if you observe the birth, and if you give your life to Jesus, uh, he will bring you justice and judgment. Judgment in the in the in the way of righteousness. It will bring you righteousness and justice. It will order your steps and it will establish everything. Forevermore, the kingdom of God, the kingdom of Jesus is established. And Isaiah, in the same way, saw the coming of Jesus. If you read Isaiah 6, Isaiah 6, verse 1 to 3, it says, In the year that King Ozia died, Isaiah said, I saw the Lord sitting on a throne, high and lifted up, and his train of his and the train of his robe filled the temple. Oh, how glorious is the coming of Jesus! His glory filled the temple. It's a glorious day. At this uh, Auspice day of the birth of Jesus Christ. If you will celebrate it with meaning, your life will never remain the same. Amen. There shall be progress. There shall be forward going. There shall be a visitation of the good things of God upon your life. And he says, his train filled the temple. Above it stood the seraphim. Each had six wings, and with two he covered his face. With two of his wings he covered his feet, and with two he flew. And he cried unto another, <laughs> and one cried unto another, and said, Holy, holy is the Lord of hosts. The whole earth is filled with his glory. Holy, holy is the Lord of all. The whole earth is filled with the glory. The glory of the Shekinah, the Shekinah glory of Jesus Christ. The Shekinah glory of the Lord be your portion tonight. Amen. Throughout the day, throughout the festivity, Amen. till December 31st, the Lord will cause his glory. The Lord will order your steps. Amen. The Lord will direct everything that concerns your life. Amen. Oh, he, he, a Savior has been born. A son has been given. Wonderful things he's, he's doing in your life. Mm -hmm. He has brought you counsel. That's why I take the trouble in telling people Christmas must be ce celebrated with wisdom. Christmas is the time of joy, a time of peace, a time of oneness. It's not a time of doing unnecessary things. It's not a time that you will you will go ahead and force yourself and go into debt. People buy unnecessary things. Mm -hmm. Be, they forget about the pure meaning of Christmas. And it's, it's a time of giving. Because we will go there, the wise men that came, they came to offer gifts. But did anybody told you, or oh, God is forcing you, if you don't have the money to go and borrow? No. And come January, you will be complaining to the whole world. Come January, any time they talk about money, you are annoyed because <laughs> you use a, a, an overdraft. You use a credit card and you are paying. And January, February, March, you are in tight waters. Does it make sense? But he is a counselor. His counsel does not bring you debt. Mm -hmm. His counsel brought, brought you joy and liberation. His counsel brought you forward going. His counsel brought you redemption and, and, and liberty from the grips of the enemy. Amen. Somebody, you are liberated tonight. Amen. Somebody, the joy of the Lord is your strength. Amen. And unto us a son is born. Yes. 
Oh, even our physical children, when we have birth, when our uh, wife deliver, when uh, 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 mothers deliver, there is joy in the home. So joy, joy unspeakable. Therefore rejoice. I say rejoice always. Let your moderation be made known unto God. And in uh, Luke chapter uh, uh, Luke chapter 2, it was said that the, the angel appeared unto uh, 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 shepherds who were watching their flock by night. And they were overwhelmed. They were taken by surprise. And they became afraid. But in Luke chapter 2, verse 11, if we can read, Luke chapter 2, verse 11, 11 and 12. Anyone who is there first, we can read. Hallelujah. Christmas is a joyful time. It's a time of celebration. It's a time that we wait upon the law. Uh, Luke 2 from 8, I read. Now they were in the same country, shepherds, living Christmas is living out. Hallelujah. Are we okay? Yes, sir. Now they were in the same country. Shepherds living out in the flock, in the fields, keeping watch over their flock by night. And behold, an angel of the Lord stood before them. Hallelujah. And the glory of the law shone around them. And they were greatly afraid. Verse 10. Then the angel said to them, Do not be afraid, for behold, I, I bring you good tidings of great joy. May you receive good tidings of great joy. He said, I bring you good tidings of great joy, which will be to all people. To all people, the birth of Jesus Christ is good tidings. It's of great joy. It's of great impact. It's of great significance to all men. It came that we might have life and have it more abundantly. It came, he saved us from the curse of this world. It came that the joy of the Lord of strength. I bring you good tidings. Just like the angels brought good tidings to the shepherds. Mm -hmm. And they say, we bring good tidings and great joy to all people. Verse 11, uh, Luke 7, Luke 2. For there is born to you this day in the city of David a Savior who is Christ the Lord. Hallelujah. There is born to you a Savior who is Christ the Lord. Christ in you, the hope of glory. Christ in you, our abundance will come to you. Christ in you, there is liberty in our communities. There is liberty in our cities. There is liberty and joy to us. Hallelujah. And uh, when you read, uh, the same uh, Luke second uh, 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 Luke two verse twenty five going when Jesus was brought for the purification in the temple there was this man uh, and behold there was a man in Jerusalem whose name was Simon. And this man was a just and a devoted man waiting for the consolation of Israel. And the Holy Spirit was upon him. And it had been revealed to him by the Holy Spirit that he will not die, he, he will see no death before he had seen the Lord. Hallelujah. He will see no death before he has seen the Lord. So he came by the Spirit into the temple, the same time that Jesus was brought into the temple. He came by into the temple. 
And when the parents brought in the child Jesus to do for him according to the custom of the law, he took him upon his hands and blessed God. May we bless God at this time. We bless God for the uh, gift that was given to us by the birth of Jesus Christ. And he blessed God and he said, I cannot die. Lord, now you are letting your servant depart in peace according to your word. For my eyes have seen the salvation and uh, the birth brought about salvation and your eyes have seen the salvation of the Lord which you have prepared before the face of all people. By the coming of Jesus, the salvation was prepared before the face of all people. A light to bring revelation to the Gentiles and the glory of your people Israel. And there again, Anna, in that same chapter, bear witness, bear witness of the Redeemer. Verse 36, now there, there was one, Anna, a prophetess, the daughter of Fidel, of the tribe of Asher. She was of a great age and had lived with her husband seven years, seventy, uh, had lived with her husband seven years from her city. And this woman, was a widow of about 84 years who did not depart from the temple but served God with fastings and prayers night and day. And coming in the instant, she gave thanks. May we give thanks. Amen. When she saw Jesus, she gave Amen. thanks. Jesus, this is a time to give thanks. And Anna gave thanks and spoke of him to all those who look for redemption in Jesus Amen. Christ or redemption in, 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 in Jerusalem. There is a scripture we will read and we will pray in Matthew chapter 2, when we read from verse 1, Matthew chapter 2, Matthew, the first book in the New Testament. Matthew chapter 2. Yes. We read as much as we can read, and it will it will make sense. Are we starting one. from verse one? Yes, okay. please. Uh, read Matthew chapter two. Now, after Jesus was born in Bethlehem of Judea, in the days of Herod the king, behold, wise men from the east came to Jerusalem, saying, "Where is he who has been born king of the Jews?" For we have seen his star in the east, and have come to worship him. When Herod the king heard this, he was troubled, and all Jerusalem with him. And when he had gathered all the chief priests and the scribes of the people together, he inquired of them where the Christ was to be born. So they said to him, In Bethlehem of Judea, for thus it is written by the prophet, By you, Bethlehem, in the land of Judea, in the land of Judah, are not the least among the rulers of Judah. For out of you shall come a ruler who will shepherd my people Israel. Then Herod, when he had secretly called the wise men, determined from them what time the star appeared. And he sent them to Bethlehem and said, Go and search carefully for the young child, and when you have found him, bring back word to me, that I may come and worship him also. When they heard the king, they departed, and behold, the star which, had, which they had seen in the east went before them till it came and stood over where the young child was. When they saw the star, they rejoiced with exceeding great, exceedingly great joy. And when they had come into the house, 
they saw the young child with Mary, his mother, and fell down and worshipped him. And when they had opened their treasures, they presented gifts to him, gold, frankincense, and myrrh. Then being divinely warned in a dream that they should not return to Herod, they departed for their own country another way. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. Now, Jesus, when he was born in Bethlehem of Judah, the star appeared unto wise men. Hallelujah. What a revelation. And the star took them. And the star brought them. And the star brought them to King Herod. It wasn't the star, but when they got to the city, they thought definitely if a king is born, he should be born in the palace. So they, they were uh, trying to use their own mind to go into the palace. And when they had gathered all uh, uh, saying, where is he who has been born king of the Jews? They inquired in the palace. Not knowing it agitates the spirit of Herod. How can I am a king? I'm not there. How can there be another king? Hallelujah. And he, he became annoyed and he called them secretly and he inquired from them. Oh, all this is to tell you the wise men came by divine provision. They were led into where Jesus was born. After they were dispatched from uh, uh, Herod's house, the star again took over and the star directed them to where the baby was born and they worship him. They worship him. Jesus, tonight we worship you. The main and the important uh, 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 of the Savior is to worship him is to acknowledge the king of kings, is to celebrate and lift him up and glorify him. It will bring to us revelation. Deep is calling unto deep. Divine providence has been made unto you. It's not the drinking. It's not the celebration. It's not the buying. All is part of it. If you are rich and you can feed the whole community go ahead and do it it's part of it but if you don't you leave the celebration and the main main purpose for the best you do not pray you do not give glory to the lord you do not thank god and you are on booze you are on food you are on everything and leave the main thing out of it the wise men when they came before they will give the, him gifts they worship him let's worship the lord let's come before his presence with singing father we thank you we bless you we celebrate you tonight and we know because you are born unto humanity, all things are working together for our good. Today, Christmas Day, I come into your home with deliverance message. God will deliver you from the snare of the fowler. God will take control over every twisted situation in your life. If you call unto him, if you look to Jesus, the altar and the finisher of your faith, and if you believe that he was, he was born sorry, for the salvation of humanity, I see you becoming a new creature. I see divine presence. I see the good things of God being bestowed upon you. I see wonders being done in your household. I see your sick child being healed. I see your sick husband being healed. I see your sick wife being healed. Power to the people. Grace and divine tidings. There will be divine encounters, divine location to your people. And the Bible says, 
when they had the king, they departed, and behold, the star which they had seen in the east went before them. May the star of Jesus come before you. May the star of Jesus from this day forth, as you have celebrate, celebrated the coming of the King, as you have lifted the name of Jesus, as you are singing Hosanna, as you are singing praises, as you are singing good tidings to the name of Jesus, may the divine providence of God take preeminence. I pray that your eyes of understanding will be flooded with light. I pray that your needs shall be met by Jesus. I pray that the light will shine upon your children. I pray that the burden shall be taken off your shoulders. The Lord will visit homes. The anointing is flowing. The power of God, the essence of Jesus Christ, the purpose for which Jesus was born will be made conformable to you. And all things will work together for your good. Hallelujah. Divine compensation. The Lord will compensate your family. The Lord will wash your head with oil. The Lord will anoint oil. Every step you take shall be blessed by the Lord. Goodness and mercy will follow you all the days of your life. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. The tables are turning in your favor because Christ in you is the hope of glory. At the mention of the name of Jesus, every knee bows today and every tongue celebrate God. Father, we honor you. Father, we bless you. And when the star took over and till it came, and stood over where the young child was. When they saw the star, they rejoiced exceedingly great joy. May you rejoice. Rejoice in the Lord. Let your moderation be made known to men. Ah, the joy of the Lord be your strength tonight. Ah, somebody, is Christmas, but you are thinking about many things. God sent me to you, and God says, I should tell you, the battle is not yours. The battle is the Lord. The Lord will fight your battle for you. The Lord will bring you deliverance, and the Lord will cause you to know that he is the rewarder of them that diligently seek him. If you will seek God, if you will depend on God, if you will leave Jesus out, all good things pertaining to godliness shall be your portion. Hallelujah. And they rejoice exceedingly great joy. And Bible says, and when they had come into the house, they saw the young child with Mary, his mother, and fell down and worshipped him. Fell down and worshipped him. Somebody tonight, let's fall down and worship him. Let's bow down and worship him. Worship the Lord. In his presence we stand. Lord, we lift you high. Lord, we come before your presence. Lord, take us from the merry clay. Lord, distangle, distangle us from the entanglement of the enemy. Somebody pray. Let the burdens and the shackles be pulled down. Let the power of the enemy take their filthy hands off you. Call upon him, he will hear you. I see God answering people. As you call on to him, he will never leave you nor forsake you. He will visit you also. He will redeem you and set you free. Power and might is coming from the Lord tonight. Yet the presence of God is tangible to your household, to your community, to your city. We pray for the boroughs of uh, London. We pray for Gaza and, uh, uh, and, and the Israelites. And we pray for the Hamas people who are bombarding. I heard that 70 people have been killed just yesterday and today. Father, oh God, let your redemption 
redemptive arm and let your power brood over uh, Gaza. Father, O oh God, stop the atrocity. It is not by the might of man, but by your power. And they worship a child. They fell down and worship him. Yes. And when they had opened their treasures, they presented gifts to him, gold, frankincense, and mel. Oh, the Lord will call somebody to give to you. And you will give somebody as well. It's a time of giving. It's a time of amendment. Giving in the form that you forgive the sins of other people. Likewise, other people forgive you your sins. Likewise, we are washed by the blood. We are sanctified by the blood. And Herod pretended as if he is on the moon, as if he was joyful with them. But Herod was a devil incarnate to destroy the plans of God and no weapon of the enemy fashioned against you because the, uh, uh, the wise men were won by the, uh, uh, by the star. Then being warned in a dream that they should not return to error, they departed for another country or another way. Let them seek you to destroy you. God will bring a way of escape. And Aaron, he inquired from his wise men, when did the star, uh, uh, do they imagine the star appeared? And from two years, he killed all the sons. But uh, the, the, the Lord won. Now when they had departed, Behold, an angel of the Lord appeared to Joseph in a dream, saying, Arise, take the young child and mother and flee to Egypt. So everything is orchestrated by God. Everything is divine. And the presence of God is divine. And tonight we are talking of the divine provision of God. If you will celebrate God, you will have divine provision. The Lord would uh, locate you divinely. The power of God will make a difference in your life. I pray that no weapon of the enemy fashioned against you and your family, the church, it will not mm -hmm. prosper. May there be divine escapes. Mm -hmm. We are talking of divine escapes. All calamities in December have been aborted by the hand of God. Mm -hmm. Jesus, the high priest of our confession. Jesus, the advocate. Jesus, the lily of the valley. Yes, Hallelujah. It's a glorious day. And I pray that the glory of the Lord will be your portion. And I pray that as you celebrate, as you have celebrated, and as you are still celebrating, let there be meaning. Let there be divine purpose for your celebration. Remember to be somebody's keeper. Remember to show love to other people. Remember to be there, occupied till Jesus comes. Oh, may the Lord make provision for Amen. you. May the Lord provide all these according to his riches in Christ Amen. Jesus. Blessed be God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us with all spiritual blessings in every place in Christ Jesus. Amen. Oh, may you change your mind. May you have a feeling of God, the love of God, agape for other people. May your mind be elasticated and may your mind be softened that divinely you will not think evil about other people. 
For if the people of God who are called by the name of God will humble themselves, pray, seek the face of God, turn from their wicked ways. The Lord says, I will hear from heaven. I will forgive their sins and I will heal their land. On this precious, uh, uh, auspicious day, at this day of the celebration of the birth of Jesus Christ, may God heal Great Britain. May God heal United Amen. Kingdom. May God heal African countries. May God heal the ocean and the, the, the uh, kingdoms of all the uh, 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 continents of the world. May that be a manifestation of the glory of God. Name. Every device of the enemy will take the uh, counsel of the law tonight and we break it in the name Amen. of Jesus. Oh, somebody who you are vulnerable. Somebody you think nothing good will come from you. For Nathaniel, he said, can anything good come out of Nazareth? But Jesus came out of Nazareth. Everything good coming to the children of God. Amen. Somebody, you have inferiority complex. Tonight, God says you will be quickened by the Amen. Spirit. Somebody, you have bowed your head in shame. God says, I'm wiping away the shame. Amen. God says, I'm giving you a new strength. Jesus name. If you would think positively, yes, you won't think negatively. Amen. Be quickened by the Spirit Amen. of God. Ah, we pray for the church as a whole. There is too much camouflage in the church. There is too much hypocrisy in the church. Lord, wash away our Amen. sins. Minister of God. Son and daughter of God, let Christ be forming you. Let the, uh, the desire of your heart be fearful towards Amen. God. Take away the hermity in your heart. I pray for the Amen. church. For there came a time Jesus has his disciples. Who do you think I am? Who do men say I am? Some say you are John the Baptist. Some say you are Elias. Some say you are Jeremiah. Some say you are some of the prophet. And Jesus turned to them and say, Who do you say I am? And Peter, by the revelation of God, say, you are the Christ, the son of the living God. And there and then, Jesus said, flesh and blood has not revealed this yes. to you. But it has been revealed to you by my father in heaven. And you are the rock. And upon this rock, I will build my church and the gates of hell shall not prevail against it. Tonight, the gates of hell may not prevail against the church. The church will march forward. Oh, the church will win every activity of the church. Father, tonight, may there be a turning around. When the Lord turned the captivity of Zion around Psalm 126, they were like them that dream. Oh, and it was said, the Lord has done great things. He has given them a laughter. He has given them a song. A song of praise. A song that we will sing and it will tickle the ears of people. Father, deliver somebody tonight. Oh, you are so weak. You are so feeble. I bring you the word of God. Every infirmity, every sickness, 
that has dominated your life over the years. The woman with the issue of blood for 12 years, she suffered hemorrhage. But when he heard that Jesus was preaching, she took courage and said, if I will but touch the hem of his garment, I will be made whole. Receive honors in the name of Jesus Amen. tonight. On this festivity of the celebration of the birth of our Lord Jesus Amen. Christ, the King of kings Amen. and the Lord Amen. of lords, salvation has come Jesus, and healing to all that are oppressed of the devil. Impartation of the power of God. Oh, Lord, quicken your servants. I use myself as a, as a point of Amen. contact. Quicken all your servants Amen. that they will speak of the truth. Jesus name. And only the truth. Yes, For you shall know the truth. And the truth you know shall make you Amen. free. Lord, I take my time and commit the radio program. Amen. Programs the top online radio shall not be limited, mm -hmm. but they shall bring deliverance mm -hmm. through the broadcasting of the word to humanity. Mm -hmm. Tonight, let the beauty of God be seen in the homes of my mm -hmm. hearers. Let the oracles of God take place. Let the presence of God be mighty. Amen. Merry Christmas. Amen. And good tidings and turning of situations, miracles, signs, and Amen. wonders are the will be the order Amen. of the day into the new year. The Lord will give you a testimony, Amen. it will tickle the ears of people, and they will know that you don't serve a dead God, but you serve a God who is able. Say, my God is, my God able, is able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above what we think or ask, according to the power that works in us. Mm. Oh, there is deliverance on the platform Amen. tonight. You, you sinner, have been given a warrant tonight. The Lord says, come to me, all ye that labor, and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. I am lowly in that and gentle in spirit. I need you to confess me as the law, as your Lord and personal Savior. The same spirit that raised Christ from the dead, that same spirit is with us on this platform. And that same spirit is speaking to you. Do not harden your heart. Mm. For you don't know the next minute. You don't know what will happen to you the next minute. If you are that sort of person I'm talking of, render your life to mm -hmm. Jesus. Give your life to mm -hmm. Jesus. Come to Jesus. He's ready. He said when you open your door, he will come in and dine yes, with you. Lord. So, dearly beloved, if you are there like this, I am inviting you to come to Jesus. And if you will take 20 seconds and ponder over the love of Jesus, over the love of the gift of Jesus, and over the forgiveness of sins, and over the miracles, and over the giftings that God has given to us. And you say, Brother Jacob, I want to give my life to Jesus. We will all say this sinner's prayer and your life will never be the same again. Dearly beloved, if you are ready. Heavenly Father, say after me, Heavenly Father, I am a sin. I cannot save myself. I come to you just as I am. Tonight, I repent of my sins. I believe in my heart unto righteousness. 
and I confess with my mouth unto salvation. I invite you to come into my life as my Savior. Receive me and be the Lord over my life. You are saved. Jesus loves you. You are welcome into the kingdom of his dear son. Dearly beloved, all of us, may the grace of God that passes all understanding keep our hearts in Christ Jesus. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year in advance. Grace is abounding. DJKB, Top Online Radio. God bless you. Thank you very much. Amen. Thank you very much, man of God, Reverend. Uh, God bless you for blessing us this Christmas. You made this Christmas a very special one for us. We are Amen. very grateful. Dear listeners and viewers, that's Reverend um, Jacob Van Der Poy of the Willing Intercessors Network. Um, I put the details of their network. It's a prayer network, so if you have any prayer requests you want them to help you pray about, you can get in, uh, get in touch with them. Um, the details are on your screens at the moment. Um, for any information about the network, please call Reverend Vanderpoint on this number on your screen, 07862712569. At the 0786272, oh, let me take it again, 0786272569. We have Zoom meetings on Wednesdays, 7 to 7.30 p.m. UK time. And the Zoom meeting IDs, uh, uh, details are on your screen. The ID is 716-399-8540. Sorry, I'll take that again. The meeting ID is 716-399-8540. And the meeting passcode is 2 capital V capital S number 8 capital P and small a. Um, the passcode again 2 capital V capital S number 8 capital P and small a for alpha. So you can call Reverend Vanderpoy on that number on your screen for any information if you want to join the prayer network. Uh, call the same number if you um, have a prayer request. Call the same number. Thank you very much, Reverend Vanderpoy. We appreciate your time. Uh, regards to you and your family. May you enjoy mm -hmm. the rest of your Christmas. I don't know if it will be too Amen. late for now to go and have your chicken. <laughs> <laughs> We've had it oh, already. Okay, then, so. uh, that, that's fine. Th Okay, Itando. thank you. Itando. Have a great evening. My regards, Bless you. our regards to your family this season. Have a great evening, sir. Amen. Same to you and same to the radio Amen. stage. Amen. God Amen. bless. Bye. Listeners and viewers, that was Reverend Jacob Van Der Poy of the Willing Intercessors Network. I believe you've been blessed through this Christmas edition of In His Presence. Uh, in the presence of the Lord, there is fullness of joy. Um, it's Christmas. We celebrate the birth of Christ, but the message, Christmas message is salvation. We should all ask ourselves that question on every day. Are we saved? Are we sure our salvation is intact? Are we sure our salvation is secured? That is, if the Lord turned up now, will we be candidates of heaven or hell? That is a summary of the salvation message. As you listen to the sound of my voice, can you ask that yourself that question? Are you doubly sure that you are saved? Are you certain that you are part of the kingdom of God? That if Christ came today, you will not be found wanting. That is a Christian uh, Christmas message. I live with you. This is DJ KB Top Online Radio UK. I believe in blessed. Um. I will not take too much of your time. I will leave you to um, continue with the <laughs> celebration. Uh, if you haven't yet had your chicken or turkey, you can have it now, but probably, yes, um, it won't give you too much stomach upset <laughs> in the night. 
One announcement, um, if you are in London in the Roy Slip area, Roy Slip, London, there is a small job, part-time job, a key job, about 12 hours a week. You can call me on this number, 079-029-44398. That is 079-029-44398. It's a part-time job in Roy Slip, London. Uh, get in touch with me on that number and I'll connect you. Um, if you haven't downloaded our free mobile radio app, please download it free of charge from our website, toponlinestation.com or go to the Play Store or the App Store and search for Top Online Radio UK. Top Online Radio UK. Also, if you are interested in this sort of you know studio work, Let's hear from us. Uh, we want to hear from you as well. Just call the number 079-029-44398. And let me uh, use this opportunity to say, um, to wish my family, um, the Bunzu family, and also the Top Online family, um, or the Top Online crew, um, Peter Mind PC, Reverend Vanderpoy, Reverend George, um, uh, Brother Daniel, and all our listeners, all our listeners, uh, we wish you a Merry Christmas and a very prosperous New Year. Wherever you are that can hear the sound of our voice, we bring you a very Merry Christmas. And a prosperous new year. The season's greetings. Keep listening to Top Online Radio UK and you'll be blessed. Please subscribe to our Facebook and YouTube channels so that every time we come on live, you will be notified. This program is proudly sponsored by Certified Accountants Limited. It is a firm of t chartered accountants and tax advisors in the UK. So if you are in the UK and you need an accountant, or a tax advisor, please call that number on your screen, 0208-226-4933. That is 0208-226-4933. Or visit their website, certifiedaccountants.org. That is certifiedaccountants.org. And you'll be blessed. Before I take leave of you, I'll take, we'll take a few messages from our sponsors. Have a Merry Christmas and a prosperous New Year. Don't go away. Kana fu awa putre ha ya se dene enya emreni mfu a wonya akwada wo emreni mu a poto kasa mu ya kasa a lawyer fu entimi ni ano ma mumi yamfu yin migwechi ni entimi ni na enko dai wamo wise smart solicitors wise smart solicitors emreni mu a kuku draw for. So what's na hache? Ombe bwa uma wansa ka wankwata. Na suwe di edron suwa. E yomu koko kwa. E bani ni pa si tine mu. E ni ejume mu nsembi ya. Omu dimu wako tine pa. Omu omre di meni pebi ya. Why smart solicitors? Always put our clients needs first. We specialize in all UK visa applications. Detention and deportation cases. Student and work points based work permit applications. From both UK and abroad. Why smart solicitors also dealt with immigration law. Family law, employment law, civil litigation, Ghanaian customary law, commissioner of oath, long residence and human rights applications outside the immigration rules. Don't wait till last minute. Wise smart solicitors for inquiries call 0208-165384. Mobile 07946-772. 439. Call our 247 line on 07931- 411042 Address 8 to 9 Print House 18 to 22 Ashwin Street Dalston E8 3DL Overground stations are Dalston Junction or Dalston Kingsland For buses 67 76 149 242 and 243 Why smart solicitors for how bad dying now be won say I need to chinye e bi de be
going to do my account and tax returns for me, cra. Certified accountant. Certified accountant. Certified accountant. Certified accountant. They will help you with your account and tax returns. Are you a minicab driver, hairdresser, shop owner, or self employed? Certified accountant. And it was all true with Chapman. And then we must say, when you will be a what bring your accounts and tax returns more. Now, Bansa so more. Now, who are you? It's in America careful. Certified accountant. And the Yamaha. So, F accounts and tax returns. Company accounts. Bookkeeping. Payroll services. Charity accounts. And gift aid claim. As of all, not to a deal. Open internet. Certified accountant. Self tax planning. Business advice. Company registration. And many more. And if you should watch your acquiring. Company. What you are going Now, what you are going to be able to do. What is the Capudio Superbro? No, what is the Certified accountant. Say say about us from the dia. What to do? Construction workers, agency workers, relief security workers, bank nursing staff. Any more we are doing our temporary workplaces in Nigeria. Mom friend, no one is going to do it. Mom, we are the only ones who can say H M R C four. I did not have that work. What you mean by H M? I just have to say what is so clear. Address three three five to three five one Raynham Road South, Dagenham R M ten eight Q R. Telephone zero two zero eight two two six. Four nine three three. Mobile zero seven nine five six eight zero four five one seven. Ah, certified accountant. Me humba ma me huwa chami. Mudi mpunti yo abame duma yume. Wise <laughs> Why smart solicitors always puts our clients' needs first? We specialize in all UK visa applications, detention and deportation cases, student and work points based work permit applications from both UK and abroad. Why smart solicitors also deals with immigration law, family law, employment law, civil litigation, Ghanaian customary law, commissioner of oath, long residence, and human rights applications outside the immigration. Immigration rules. Don't wait till last minute. Why smart solicitors? For inquiries, call 02080-165-384. Mobile 07946-772-439. Call our 24-7 line on 07931-411-042. Address 8 to 9 Print House, 18 to 22 Ashwin Street, Dalston, E8. 3DL. Overground stations are Dalston Junction or Dalston Kingsland. For buses, 67, 76, 149, 242, and 243. Why smart solicitors? For how bad dying? Now, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, I'm For more Ghanaian content in the UK and around the world, Tune in to Top Online Radio UK. We bring you news, views, interviews, and what have you. Download our free mobile radio app from the App Store and the Play Store. Just search for Top Online Radio UK. We stream live on Facebook and YouTube. For all inquiries, advertisement or to work with us contact us on 0044-7902-944-398 Top Online Radio UK The Top Ghanaian Station in the UK